Okay, so far I finished up the player's suit. It looks good enough. I'm just gonna take it as it is, export it out, and then import it to studios. I don't wanna put any more detail into it because if I start putting detail into the suit, I'll probably go overboard with it and waste a lot of time putting detail into it that don't need to be there. So I'm just gonna leave it as it is and then just export it out and import it into studios. Alright, I just got done importing the armor and also putting it on a player so the player can wear it. And I think it's fine. We're gonna give it a quick test and make sure everything works and nothing like falls off or glitches and stuff like that. Looks good. There's no glitches, armor's not falling off, so everything is working perfectly. But now we need to do something about this guy because he does not look like a alien monster thing so we need to make him look more like an enemy and um yeah i'll see what i can do in blender and hopefully it looks good So this is the alien type creature I came up with. Uh, it looks pretty cool. He's alright. I'm not gonna like animate him or make him look like a hundred times gross and weird and creepy. I'm not gonna do all that. I don't have time for that. So I'm just gonna leave him like this and he's good enough for the game. So yeah. I'm not really a good animator, but this is a decent animation. I'll take it. I'll probably make the run animation at the end because it took a lot of time to make and I don't have any more time left. I have a few days, so I have to hurry up. So for the health bar, I use the Surface GUI because I never used them before and I just want to see how it is. Um, it works. It takes damage and then it regenerates after a while, but it doesn't stay on the actual player. It just floats there in the air. I think I know what I'm doing wrong, but I'll fix it later. I'm just gonna move on to the next thing. So I'm not in one place and working on one thing for too much time. So I'm just gonna move on for now. And we'll come back to it at the end if we have time. But we might just have to use a screen GUI. But I made a targeting system as well. So you can unlock on enemies and then you'll be able to beat them up and stuff. But you can't fight back yet. I haven't scripted that yet. But so far, the targeting system works. You get a weapon eventually. But you start off with your fist and um, yeah, once you beat like level 2 or something, you get a weapon. So far, it seems to be working. And now I'm going to start fitting the map together because I have not did much with the map. So I should probably start fitting the map together and fitting the scripts in one game. So, we can have a, so we'll have a playable game at the end of the month.
and that's all I have for you this week. Uh, this is probably this is the last week. I have five days left, so this is gonna be very tough. And I got for some all nighters, but we'll get it done. Um, so yeah, if you like the content, feel free to like the video and also subscribe. And I'll see you uh, in the next video.